Hey YouTube, it's Frank from Lubeck Enterprises again. So today we're back with a different kind of issue. This is an issue with a TV. So basically this one gentleman I know, he would like to have uh, access to Netflix on his TV. He doesn't want to go out and buy a smart TV. So the initial, initial suggestion would be to get an Amazon Fire Stick or something like that that you could just plug into an HDMI port and it'll work. Well, the issue is he's only got two of them on his TV. One's occupied by a soundbar, the other's occupied by Comcast. So in order to switch between Netflix and Comcast TV, he would have to unplug one, you know, unplug the soundbar, plug in uh, Netflix, and then he can't use the soundbar. Or he can unplug Comcast, plug in uh, the Fire Stick for Netflix. But to keep going back and forth between that is just a giant pain in the butt. So, today I uh, received the parts, so to help solve all this, what I did was, besides to buy the fire stick that is over there, I bought this. And I've actually bought this in the past, which is why I bought it for him, and it's also why there are two of them here. Mine's on the bottom, his is on top. So I just finished hooking everything up, it's power in that end output here, this goes to the TV, and two inputs. I have Comcast and my PS3. So, theoretically, when I turn this TV on, it should have Comcast, and then when I turn on my PlayStation down there, I'm not showing any more of it than that, <laughs> and um, it'll switch over to that automatically. So, just to test things out, let's go ahead and Powered on. Sweet. Said, Ooh, wipe up. I haven't watched that in forever. Should I go on here? Oh, wait, no. That's right, I don't have to do this one. I don't have to even touch the remote. All I have to do is tap this button, and it should put my PlayStation on the television. That's a very good sign so far. Give it a second. Yeah. So it seems the USB switch works. And just one more time to make sure it in, to ensure it works properly. Now that it's all booted up, I'm going to go ahead and turn it off, and it should go back to Comcast. And there we go. So the HDMI box, or HDMI switch, or HDMI hub, whatever you prefer to call it, that's okay. That's working fine. So now it's time to unbox the Fire Stick and go ahead and test it. Now I've never actually used one of these things, so yeah, should be interesting. I wonder if I can get it on the first try. We'll see. <laughs> 